Now, as the weather cools down, it's that time of year when the doctor's office fills up with patients. Now, this year, RSV is making a big comeback. 27 News reporter Alyssa Storm is live at a pedi pediatrician's office in central Topeka where they are treating multiple cases of the virus. Mackenzie, sadly, I am not the only one visiting the doctor today. This clinic has already seen four kids today with respiratory issues. As flu season creeps up on us, health experts say that another virus parents should be aware of is RSV. RSV, or a respiratory syncytial virus, is transmitted when an infected person coughs or sneezes. This virus can cause severe infections in some people, including babies, young children, older adults, people with lung and heart disease, or anyone with a weak immune system. Symptoms resemble the common cold, but if they are left untreated, can lead to more serious health issues. You can get it into other complications, whether it be pneumonia or other, and it can also affect other people, especially if they're diabetic, have hypertension. RSV can affect any age. Doctors say RSV takes three to eight days for the symptoms to fully show, which is why the virus is so easy to spread. RSV is most contagious in those first three to eight days, but symptoms can linger for weeks. Health professionals say the easiest way not to get RSV is to be extra cautious of your health by washing your hands thoroughly multiple times a day and avoid going out if you're sick. Reporting live in Central Topeka, working for you, Alyssa Storm, 27 News.